Force balloonist Captain Joseph Kittinger Jr. is laced into an elaborate pressure suit in preparation for a daring ascent into the stratosphere. Kittinger, who weighs 150 pounds, packs 155 pounds of suit and equipment. He has to be helped into the open gondola of the balloon. His goals, a new altitude record for non-powered flight and a new record for the longest jump in history. A fragile plastic gas bag goes up from Tularosa, New Mexico. The scientific goals of Kittinger's ascent are to test a new six-foot stabilizer parachute designed to keep an ultra-high altitude jumper from spinning and blacking out before he can open the main chute and to get new data on the functioning of the human body under conditions close to those of space flight. The balloon reaches a height of 19 and a half miles. An automatic camera in the gondola films the leap and Kittinger falls free plummeting 16 miles before opening his chute. His maximum speed, 450 miles an hour. A little over three miles from the ground, Kittinger opens his parachute. A slight leak in one of his pressure gloves prevented him from operating some equipment. But the mission is a complete success. He hits the New Mexico desert with four new records for balloon flight, open gondola flight, free fall, and the longest parachute jump. He can't move till he's helped out of that suit. Kittinger's swollen hand returned to normal soon after, and he walks away a man of high achievement, high spirits, and high courage.